Here's how the, uh, the tester works. You can see it has two jacks. One's RJ11 and the other is RJ45. The writing is switched, but the RJ11's here and the RJ45's on this side. So that's what this is plugged into. And what this does is I have this plugged into the cable, the end of the other end of the cable. I keep a, a jack on the raw cable just for this exact purpose. And so all this does is it sends a signal down through each strand, each separate of uh, the eight strands. Remember there's twisted pair, there's four twisted pairs, so that's eight total strands, eight total cables. So it just sends a signal down each separate cable, and then the, you'll see the tester in a moment on the other end test to see if it's receiving the same signal at the same time. All right, so now you can see the two together. You can see that this one's plugged into the cord coming out of the ceiling, and then the other one is still plugged into the other end of this cable. So you don't need a live land signal to test. All we're doing is sending a tone down the cable from one end to the other. And what you want is you want to see the same numbers light up at the same time. If you get a mismatch, that means that your cable is different on one end than the other. Maybe you um, just, you know, got a, a wire crossed. Could be all kinds of things that happen. But if you have solid signals, just like we're seeing here, that's exactly what you want. That means the same tone is going down the same wire at the same time. Thanks for watching my videos. I hope you're finding them useful or at least a little entertaining. Um, Listen, I just finished a book on home automation. It's designed for complete beginners, and I'm making a few chapters available for free online. The book is written for the complete beginner, and the idea is that it would help you choose equipment all the way through installing it in your home. If you're interested, just put the word home automation, one word, in the comments of this video, and I'll send you a copy of the PDF for free. If you'd rather, you can go online through my profile link, and you can read the chapters there. All right, thanks, and happy DIYing.